Brox didn't recognize the man, but it wasn't like he kept track of the well-fed oligarchs who ran the city. Instead, Brox raised his drink to the warriors who had likely never been allowed inside this building before. Siblings of Etonia! A roar greeted his words as the lithe warriors scattered throughout the room cheered. Many of them raised weapons towards the ceiling, reveling in their victory. I think this was the first battle for most of them. I envy them that, to confront your own mortality for the first time and survive the experience, it's never as intense as the first time. That thought spawned another one, and Brox's lips quirked as he looked over the crowd awaiting his next word. It shouldn't have been their first battle. They need to be more self-reliant. I know it's my turn on the Questor roster for Etonia, but I don't want to have to come save them every other year, and I'm not about to sit down and waste a decade training them up. It was with that thought in mind that he continued his speech. We have won a great victory today defeated the encroaching blight of the undead, and smashed the source of that foul magic. It was an honor to fight by your side. I should count how many times I've said that phrase on Devrar. Probably hundreds. The hall shook with cheers, but Brox held out a calming hand. They quieted quickly, and he shivered at the feeling of hundreds of people obeying his will. I could have done a strategist build if I really wanted that, 